So in this next video we show the uh, static modulation of a much larger backlight, a 6 inch uh, wide uh, diameter. And the way we did this is by uh, overlaying a high resolution uh, printed mask that uh, we ordered at a print shop for about $50 with the uh, pixel size uh, of about uh, 18 micron. We overlay to uh, a mask of uh, some of the uh, colored pixels to create a 3D image. As you can see, the uh, mixing of colors is achieved here through uh, special dithering of color. So we can see various patterns. We had a butterfly and flower, and this one is a, a bike on some uh, uh, tiled uh, ground. And you can see that the tiles are a little bit jumpy. Uh, and the reason is that they actually extend. Uh, far away uh, from the uh, zero disparity plane. This uh, next uh, test pattern was actually a bunch of uh, snowflakes and here we were testing the ability to represent objects uh, pretty far from the uh, plane of the display. So here is plus minus two centimeter and the ability to mix color. So you can see in that central pattern uh, we try to achieve uh, white in the center and then you have also the three primary colors red, green and blue and also uh, the pair uh, of them which is uh, a cyan yellow and uh, magenta next we move on to um, our attempt to represent some kind of urban landscape which is actually um, a bunch of blocks, uh, cubes and things like that and we were trying to um, overlay some uh, uh, colored blocks in a in a way that is well aligned. So, for example, the the top of some of the blocks is the green or blue color, while the sides are red. And finally, uh, probably the most uh, impressive achievement so far is this uh, 3D image of a turtle showing the uh, very wide amount of uh, parallax. So you can move around the turtle and see the top of the head, the back, the left and right eye. So you can move around a lot.